Hi, I'm Rob Dom, and while this timing chain might look better around my neck than inside any of my rotary engines, this is probably one of the most critical components affected by wear inside of your engine. Any sort of changes to this microscopically will affect the timing in your engine and cause a lot of problems. When you look at all these pins, you're talking about maybe half a percent, 0.2% of a difference. And over all of these pins, you can't feel it. You can't grab this and tell me, oh, that's a, that's a good timing chain or not. Thankfully, the engineers over at Valvoline's Engine Lab allowed me to tag along and learn more about how Valvoline measures timing chain wear and formulates the product to minimize it. So this, this is the chain wear test? Yes, it is. Okay, uh, what, what all is involved with a chain wear test? So chain wear test basically is checking for timing chain wear. So the timing chain is the piece, uh, it looks like a bicycle chain that goes okay. between the crankshaft and the camshaft. Okay, and, and that chain breaking or wearing is bad for the engine. So how does oil play a factor in protecting that from happening? So engine oil is, plays essential role uh, in controlling, of course, lubrication, but controlling the wear of the chain. I see, and so you're controlling a lot of different aspects yeah. that the car would experience. Correct, so pretty much all the operating uh, variables are controlled. So, it, it, you know, everything, temperature, pressure, flows, uh, speed, load, uh, temperature of oil, coolant, you know, pressures, everything. What I understand is that Valvoline's trying to maximize the amount of life this engine can have. Correct. And you're measuring the, the, the wearness of the, Correct. you're measuring the wear of the chain. Co Correct. Okay. Valvoline is making the engine oils, motor oils, which lubricate these engines, trying to target to minimize the wear that's happening around the engine. So in this case, it's a timing chain wear. Okay. So we're minimizing that and that maximizes the life. And uh, we, we, don't, we just don't want to meet the, uh, you know, expectations or the uh, standards. We want to blow them out of the water, so we want to surpass them. So that's our goal. So how does Valvoline achieve up to 50% more? We know how to pick the best ingredients that's out there, put them in right amount and right combinations, balance the combination formula out, create our proprietary blends, and do rigorous testing on engine stands like this. This is how we arrive at high performance oils. So how does a test like this come about? Some OEMs uh, like Ford reported that they were having problems with uh, timing chain wear in, in the field. Okay. So we work with OEMs and Ford to develop uh, this type of test, which would capture those, those issues that are seen in the, out in the field, in the real world, into a, a laboratory type of environment. So why does this chain wear test matter so much? Well, if you have a piston engine and that chain stretches, your timing is off, and especially on a performance engine, that's changing everything. That is a very big problem to have on a performance engine as well as just about any passenger vehicle there is. So the longer you can keep the engine in good shape, the absolute better that is.